Don't judge me. I'm a map, 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 I'm a map. These are the best. So this weekend was really amazing. But before I talk about that, I have some very exciting news that I've been wanting to tell you. And I was going to tell you in the last vlog, but then I didn't know if I could. And I didn't know if it would be finalized yet. And Anyway, it's final now, and I'm really excited. So a few months ago, I found out about this anthology that was going to be published in an ebook. Um, there's this publisher that does all ebooks, um, and they were they had open submissions for a few different anthologies, one of which was like a fantasy um, creature of the night anthology with like ghosts and zombies and vampires and stuff like that. And I thought that sounded really cool. I love to write. So I started writing the story over the summer at my aunt's house in Utah. And then about a week and a half ago, I saw on Facebook that um, they were still accepting submissions, but they needed them by that night. So I finished writing it that day. I printed it. I edited. I fixed all the errors in my manuscript, and then I sent it out. Really, she emailed me at about 1 or 2 in the afternoon, but it felt like all day I was waiting. Um, and finally, when the email came, it said, Hey, Allison, I liked your story a lot. Um, I want to put it in the anthology, and I'm sending you a contract tonight. <laughs> so, I'm being published. It's going to be an ebook, so it actually probably will be out a lot faster than a hard copy would. Um, I, I don't have all the details yet, but when I find out, I will let you know. In the meantime, though, you should check out my new website. It's www.allisonridley.com. Um, I'll put it down here just so you can see and know. And I'll put a link in the doobly-doo. Yeah. So other than that, this weekend was actually really exciting. Um, I went down to Phoenix and I got to see Caleb Nation. I went to his book signing and it was so much fun. There weren't very many people there, um, which is kind of sad on the one hand because people didn't get to come see Caleb. But on the other hand, my new friend Elizabeth and I <laughs> decided to be his groupies. And so we just hung out with him pretty much the whole time. He was there about an hour and 15 minutes. Um, and a few people came, but mostly it was us and one other guy. There were It was pretty much just the three of us the whole time with Caleb. I told you guys last week that I have a crush on him. Well, now that I've met him in real life, it's grown. I really hope I get to see him again in person. It was just fantastic and amazing and awesome. And I, it was just so cool. <laughs> um, we talked a little bit about uh, that, like, that weird thing where you go to an event and you see this, like, celebrity or this person who's famous in your group or uh, whatever, however they're famous, and you meet them. And it's like, oh, I got to meet so-and-so. And then you go again and again into, like, maybe three or four events, and suddenly it's this person who you've met several times and kind of know. And I really hope that I can get that. I really hope that that can be the case with Caleb, because he's such a cool guy, and I really I'd really like to see him more I said this last time and I'll say it again Caleb you're watching and if you ever need a date I'm the one I'm not gonna lose hope on that you guys I am not gonna lose hope yes I know I've only met him once but hey that's that's why you go on dates with people to get to know them hey I gotta put it out there right can't hurt the weekend was so much fun like I said, Caleb Nation is such a cool guy. You should check him out. I'm going to put a link to his YouTube channel in the doobly-doo. Oh, I forgot. I wore my Beard Lover shirt to the signing, and it was pretty awesome. So go Team Beard! Woo! So if you saw Caleb's tweet with the two people wearing YouTuber shirts, I was the girl. Yeah! One more thing that was awesome about this week. Um... I wrote a blog about Mike Lombardo because I adore him. I'm going to put a link to that down here in the doobly-doo, too. Um, I'll put a link to my blog about Mike, and I'll put a link to Mike's 
YouTube channel just so you can check him out because he is amazing. I just love him. So now that I've told you all about the YouTube guys that I adore, I'm going to call it a night. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys have a great night and I will see you next week. Bye.